What's up, gang? It's your boy, Bluminati and... Twisted Sis. Coming at you with, in case you couldn't tell, <laughs> a new Tempest Knives offering. This is a drop coming from KC, a.k.a. Knives Fast, a.k.a. Tempest Knives. If you're all familiar with his uh, pinion, microburst, jet stream, <laughs> fractus was his latest one. Fractus? Yeah. And now we have the micro jet. He has taken the very cool jet stream and shrunk it down just a wee bit. Uh, that's that's a mean knife, definitely. I like them smaller. So it's definitely a little bit more of the size yeah. of the micro burst. With just a little bit uh, thinner blade. So what we are looking at is the Firestorm version of the Tempest Microjet. It's going to be dropping on the Tempest Knives website uh, soon. I'm not sure when. Uh, but definitely keep an eye out on TempestKnives.com. Uh, he's oh. already got them. So we're getting to check out a... This is a prototype. Prototype. Yeah, this is a prototype. That's cool. Yeah. Thank you. Yep. He uh, put it into the Lefty Pass Around group so that we could all check it out. Well, that's awesome. Yep. There are five different variants. This one is the Firestorm version. And this is a seven inch overall length with a three inch blade. Uh, it'll be in 154 cm that is going to be tested to 62 HRC. The prototype that I have in my hand here is in D2. I do believe they do all of their prototypes in D2 blade steel. So uh, as far as blade edge longevity, we, we wouldn't be able to test any of that because this is going to be D2 versus what the production knife will be. But as far as geometry and stuff, it's definitely a sharp knife. And I'm okay with these two. I, oh, yeah. I have, I have no complaints. Of course, I don't do, like, you know, hardcore cutting or anything. Yeah. Well, I, most of us don't do hardcore cutting, but... Yeah, I don't need to go through garden hoses or, or cables or... <laughs> I don't know, whatever else that might... We're not scab. We don't go through industrial uh, sandblast hose. Yeah, exactly. But... So. For breaking down your Amazon boxes, that's going to do just fine. The cutting geometry on that blade, nice tall flat grind, it's going to do great. You have a reversible uh, pocket clip. Yes, uh, milled titanium pocket clip. Milled titanium. What do they mean by milled? So you got your wire clips. Uh huh. You've got like the bent steel clips. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah. Kind of like that. Yeah. Uh, and when they're milled, if they take a piece of titanium and they put it, it starts out as a little block of titanium and they take a machine and mill it out to the shape. Okay, got it. So that's what a mill, milled clip is. Okay. So this, this little clip started out as a solid piece of titanium. Right. And then they put it in a CNC mill, and it well, that's cuts it cool. out of the okay. cuts it out of the material. I think that would be neat to watch. Yep. Uh, four inch handle, three inch blade, blade stock thickness is 0. 0.12 inches. Again, 100, 154 <laughs> cm blade steel. It is a drop point with a whole fuller deployment. No thumb studs. I think the only blade so far that KC has put thumb studs on is the microburst, as you can see here. Uh, clip, backspacer, and all the screws are titanium. 
the scales are slightly contoured and milled. Not sure if that, well, it's definitely very slightly contoured. Uh, you can definitely see the milled pattern. Maybe. Yeah, there we go. See that milling on the blade. You got the reversible pocket clip. There is some lanyard lover, uh, <laughs> lanyard user love. <laughs> I think that I said that right. Uh -huh. Lanyard user love. Lanyard love. There, lanyard love. I think he has that on majority of his. Yeah, it's on the it's on the main jet stream. Uh oh no, it's not on the uh, Fractus. He didn't put any lanyard love there. Uh, and nothing on the pinion. I'm pretty sure, yeah, there was some on the, uh, microburst. So, he's batting three out of five so far with some affection <laughs> towards the lanyard guys. Said this is the, uh, Firestorm version, flame anode tie, acid wash, acid stone washed blade, acid stone washed hardware. Uh, it is OEM by Kubi. Uh, currently this would be the fourth model that is OEM by Kubi. The only one that isn't OEM by Kubi is the Fractus, which was done by Concept. And he's already got some other ones that are fixing the drop. Of course, he also has the, uh, which I don't have the fixed blade with me. I knew I was missing one more. The Kubi Dust Devil, the blue handle one. Oh, yeah. It's, a... <laughs> it's my steak knife, too. <laughs> but as you can see, it is a smaller version of the jet stream. Feels really good in hand. That jimping is nice and aggressive, and there's plenty of it there. You can choke up on this. I don't know where it's at. It was in the uh, jar with the markers. <laughs> it's right in front of me. You have nested liners that are. Ow. You all right there? Yeah, I'm good. Yeah. No. Nope. That are skeletonized. There is some weight reduction inside there. There's his other blade. Fixed blade. His fixed blade. The Kubi Dust Devil, the 14C 2080N. So in case you couldn't tell, I kind of like Casey's designs. <laughs> definitely, definitely good looking uh, little folder. I'm definitely going to dig it. What do you think, Twisted? If I can get get off the bed, the, 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 the steps. Oh, wow. Yeah, that feels real good in my hand. Sturdy. Not too heavy. But it's got some some heft to it, you know. Ooh, I like that flipper action there. That is cool. I like that where he's got this out. Oh, yeah. Yeah, this is uh, definitely a very nice knife. I definitely play with it for sure. <laughs> oh yeah. Yep. Good job, Casey. Mm. Like I said, you got the whole fuller deployment and of course the minimal uh flipper tab. Very nice. Great uh jimping on that flipper tab. As you can see on here versus the jet stream you can see he had he took the cant of the blade where it kind of swoops up he took it out oh, if yeah. you can see that you see how the blade kind of comes up uh-huh he took that out of the micro jet oh yeah but definitely great action mm -hmm. i can't wait to pick one of these up 
They should be dropping a couple weeks from now, I think. 140 bucks. Hmm? They have, like I said, he's going to have five, five versions. You're going to have the flame tie anode. You're going to have the Tempest Knives, uh, the Tempest Microjet, which is the blue handle tie. Ooh. See, I, I'd like to get the, the blue and the flame anode so I could put the black blade on the blue handle. <laughs> Uh, there's also going to be the silver jet, which was like the silver, uh, jet stream that I sent, uh, twist, uh, not twisted, Stella. Oh, okay, yeah. And then there's, uh, a carbon fiber version. Oh. That's called the micro jet night sky. Uh -huh. So you'll have silver jet, night sky, the tempest micro jet, the firestorm, and then a mystery one, which we will find out when he drops it. Really? There you go, guys. Another awesome uh, offering from KC over at Knives Fast and Kubi. Thanks uh, for the opportunity for letting us for us getting to check it out. Yes, definitely. Thank you, KC, we'll for right in a letting us check this bad boy out. So, guys, y'all keep an eye out on TempestKnives.com. Uh, you're not going to want to miss these guys. Definitely another great offering. You can follow KC over at Knives Fast on YouTube, uh, Tempest Knives US over on Instagram, and of course, TempestKnives.com is the actual sale website. So, with that, it's your boy Blue and Twisted CS. We're signing off. Guys, don't forget to do something kind for somebody. Be a knife nerd. Keep them sharp. We'll check you on the next one. Peace. Bye.